What are the main environmental issues facing an integrated pulp and paper producer in Indonesia? Environmental issues cannot be separated from social issues in Indonesia. You cannot just talk about environmental issues, not talk about social issues. So if your question is asking me what are the main environmental issues, I have to tell you the, question, uh, the, the answer for uh, social issues as well. Because you cannot just address environmental issues away from social issues because they're just related to each other. I'll give you an example such as um, biodiversity, forest biodiversity protection. It sounds like it's just environmental issues, but actually social issue is closely related to that. For example, biodiversity is destroyed by illegal encroachment, and illegal encroachment comes from poverty. So environmental issues, such as biodiversity protection of the, of the forest in Indonesia, is very closely linked to poverty issues in Indonesia. So those two are two main issues in integrated pulp and paper industry in Indonesia. APP is based in Indonesia, so how are you addressing your carbon footprint? Since 2006, we have been concocting a very solid strategy to combat global warming within APP. In 2007, we engaged environmental resource management to conduct a dual approach assessment. One is a social footprint assessment and two is the carbon footprint assessment because the two issues cannot be separated from each other. That's particularly impressive because, of course, being based in Indonesia, you don't have to be subject to the carbon emissions caps. That's right. As a developing country, Indonesia is not part of the uh, carbon cap emission under uh, Kyoto Protocol. But as part of an uh, ethical, um, um, responsible member of the global community, we need to do this voluntarily and proactively. So how is APP addressing its carbon footprint? Right now, we are uh, promoting the uh, pulpwood plantation that will sequestrate quite a lot of carbon above ground and also below ground. And secondly, we are also reducing uh, the carbon emission in the mills itself by promoting efficiency of the machines and using more environmentally friendly energy. How do you balance the needs of the environment with the needs of the customer and the needs of the firm? Actually, it goes beyond that. It goes beyond the needs of the firm, the customer and the environment because as a responsible company we need to also support the other two important stakeholders which is the government and the community. We need to support the government to alleviate poverty in Indonesia. And what is APB doing to see that it addresses the needs of all its stakeholders? A multi-stakeholder approach is the basis of all APP sustainability initiatives. In any initiative that we've done or we're doing or we're going to do, we have to involve as many stakeholders as possible. The community, for example, we need to listen to them addressing what they need. Is it jobs? Is it education? Is it more empowerment? Is it training? Those we all provide to them. How do you ensure APP's supply chain is sustainable? Our procurement policy plays a very crucial role to ensure the sustainability of our supply chain. Our procurement policy identify the risks involved in the supply chain. For example, the majority of our raw material is wood. So we have to make sure that our wood supply is of 100% legal source and from sustainably managed forest. So what steps can customers take to ensure they're making good purchasing decisions? All of APP's sustainability initiatives are independently verified by third-party organizations. This starts from the wood supply to carbon footprint assessment, social footprint assessment, up to certification of our products. What more does APP do to encourage customers to find out more about the firm's sustainability initiatives? We encourage all stakeholders, not just customers, to have a look at our operations, to visit our production facilities, to visit our pulp wood plantation, to have a look at our wood supply chain of custody to have a look at our forest protection initiatives and other sustainability efforts that we've done so far. So do you see APP as a climate leader? Oh absolutely, APP is the first pulp and paper company in the world who conducted a dual approach in carbon and social footprint assessment to know where we are, to develop a baseline to further improve our sustainability strategy. To achieve one is our objective to reduce greenhouse gas emission in all our production facilities and then secondly to be able to one day produce carbon neutral paper.